we wanted to start out by shouting out to some of our fans. Hello, Hector De La Garza. And hello, Farrakh Jaki. We hope we said your names right. Thank you guys so much for watching our videos. Josh and I just got back from an ancient archaeology dig site where we were excavating old relics to review. In this process, we discovered an ancient human practice called biking. biking. As far as we can decipher from the ancient manuscripts, humans were able to go at superhuman speeds while balancing precariously on two circles. I've also heard that some special humans were able to get up to three feet of air that time. Yeah, I've heard that too. Today we're going to review this ancient practice. Today, Isaiah and I are going biking! Ooh! Welcome to Bros Review! This practice is so old and long forgotten that we are unable to track down a single known bicycle contraption. And since we want two of these, we decide we'd make them ourselves. Basing our design from the ancient inscriptions, taking some metal, and doing a little hammering, we made these! Feast your eyes on these amazing relics reanimated! While bringing back this ancient practice, one of our main goals is to learn how to master these metal steeds of fury. This practice looked much simpler and safer on old clay tablets. In actual reality though, it's sort of a thing of beauty once you get up to insane ultra-human speeds. There are no other experiences I can compare it to. <laughs> After mastering the art of balance and speed, we decided to reenact some of the scenes depicted in the ancient inscriptions, as well as invoke the ancient words, you got like three feet of air that time. You got like three feet of air that time. <laughs> It sounds like a crappy country song at the end, because you're like, time. <laughs> How does that sound like a country song? I don't know, just like the transition time. between E and just going to mm, sounds like you're putting an accent on it. That's so time. awesome. Time. <laughs> Backing turns out to be an extremely fun and efficient way of getting around. In fact, Josh and I bike all the time. Sometimes we go on like 15 mile bike rides together just to go from town to town or city to city and it's really cool seeing the beautiful scenery and just getting out and not being on technology all the time. Um, in this video we just really want to encourage you guys to break out your bike if you still have one or to just go pick one up at a garage sale or something if you don't have one. It's super fun. And also you can do some pretty crazy like life-changing experiences on a bike. I have some friends that all got together and they biked across several states together and they had a bunch of cool stories and they had a good time. And I even have a friend that biked across the entire United States. In fact, he might even be still on that journey. I haven't heard from him in a while. But I mean, that's really cool. He's got so many experiences and so many cool places he got to see. Remember to join us next week when we review something new. And subscribe to keep up to date on all our latest content. We hope this review helped. Thanks guys. Later. Later. <laughs> hello Hector De La Garza. And hello he Hector De La Garza. <laughs> Let's see, I want to say more window. People need to know that there's air. There's freedom on the other side. Freedom on the other, other side. side. I'm tone deaf but at least I try! <laughs> <laughs> I do that like every week. Really? That's, yeah. that's awesome! Archaeology. <laughs> <laughs> so fascinated by it. Ha ha ha!